watching KMVT News with Joe Martin and your weather with Chief Meteorologist Eric Brill. This is KMVT News at 10. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for tuning in for your News at 10 tonight. I'm Joe Martin. As we reach the second week of crisis standards of care in Idaho, healthcare workers in the Magic Valley are pleading with the public to do what they can to help reverse the trend. KMVT's Zach Brewer spoke with a St. Luke's Magic Valley doctor about his experience. During an unprecedented health crisis, doctors around the Magic Valley say they see trust waning. It's tough. You, um, you, you say you trust me enough to, to come into the hospital for my care, but you don't trust me enough when I, when I tell you that the people that I see here in the hospital that are, that are doing the worst are the ones that have been unvaccinated. Dr. Duff says he will continue to urge people to do the simple things they can to help stay out of the hospital, masking, distancing, and getting vaccinated as an effort to keep them from learning the hard way. I don't know how you, how you, how you convey this without them seeing it for themselves or unfortunately experiencing it um, firsthand as either they have it or their loved ones. Are. And during this pandemic, doctors just don't know what's next. You intubate some people, you put them on life support, and some of them you just you know that this is the last time that they're going to be awake. Death is nothing new to healthcare providers, but Dr. Duff says this pandemic has made it harder to watch. This is something we trained for, but as far as the, the sheer amount of deaths that we see and the way people are dying is, is um, heart wrenching. Dr. Duff pleads with his neighbors. Do what you can to help the Magic Valley community. I grew up here in, in, in Magic Valley. I grew up in Paul, and I know the people here. There are uh, people in Twin Falls, Kimberly, Jerome, Rupert, Paul, Habern. I know you guys are, are, are good people and would do anything to help um, your, your fellow man here in, in this area. Vaccinations and masks will, will do that. Zach Brule, KMBT News.